top up on you know, all the body is full of spots. So you know when some people go into trauma internally, well externally we can see those changes. I don't know about yourselves, do you, do you end up, I know when people get really angry, some people cry when they're fighting so that you've got water coming out of their eyes. And in terms of internal damage, there's a lot of internal damage that goes with trauma. So your responsibility from a PI point of view is just make sure they're okay emotionally yeah. before and after the struggle. That's why I try and talk to people. It sounds scary, you know, because I mean, sometimes you you can think, well, I'll knock him out. But if there's trauma there, I mean, I could restrain any of you today and then tomorrow you... Uh, a restraint-related death is classified as someone that dies within 24 hours of being restrained. So they'll, they'll go away and I say, you're okay, are you sure you're okay? They'll go again, they'll go, but something will happen to them because after a restraint, after all that trauma, the body starts to produce acids and that's what does the damage. Uh, so you haven't completely reassured someone. That's what I say whenever I'm holding someone. Nobody likes to be held and not told. So I'll write down the words, tell your, tell your perpetrators what